This lighting is so much better when you have a ring light. Oh, that's kind of just makes me look like a ghost. Oh well, what else is new? Let's blend this in. Oh dear. Oh, that's a lot thicker than I thought it was gonna be. <gasps> oh no, I thought you weren't gonna be that thick. I didn't put too much. Just kidding, I guess I did put too much. Okay, well, blendy, 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 blendy. Okay, well, let's pretend I did it on purpose. I'm going for the, <laughs> I'm going for the extra flawless look today. Apparently, that was definitely my plan. All right, now the question is, am I using foundation or am I using BB cream? Let's go for a full coverage today. That wasn't my plan, but I guess I can get on that. Does it annoy you when people don't tie their hair up when they're doing their makeup? That always, it didn't, it didn't really bother me that much, but then someone pointed it out in the comment section of someone's video and I never stopped noticing it, so now it kind of bugs me. Ah, ah! Just get foundation everywhere. I spend far too much time trying to blend out BB cream and foundation. The reason I'm wearing this sweatshirt today is because yesterday was Thanksgiving and Thanksgiving means eating 16 pounds of food, which means you want to, ah, I'm falling over. <laughs> which means that you uh, need something baggy to wear the next day slash the day of. So I wore a giant sweater yesterday and a sweatshirt today. That is a lie. I wear sweatshirts every day. This is gonna be a hell of a long video to edit. I should probably not film the whole thing, but I'm having fun. Sultry. Abigail. All right, powder, because if I don't powder, I become an oily bitch. I'm like curious about like traditions that people have and like the different, I don't know, foods that their family eat together. My family, and by family I mean mom, cooks a lot of soup. Well, soups and stews and like noodle and rice dishes that are like have thick sauce stuff. <laughs> thick with two C's. I need to stop. She makes a lot of, a lot of dinners that involve having some sort of rice or noodle with a meat sauce of some sort on top of it. Super good. Is the camp tilted? Ugh. Okay, that, I, that's probably not better. You know, you can deal with it. Just pretend you're standing there looking at me like this. <laughs> Loud wire. Is it even entertaining to watch me do my makeup? I don't think it is. Although I like watching people do their makeup, even if it's like the most basic, boring stuff, because I feel like everyone has a different process and it's really interesting to watch it, I think. There's gonna be a trend in like 2025, which is not even that far away, where everyone shaves off every bit of body hair that they have including their head and their eyebrows and their eyelashes. They're gonna get rid of everything. You know why? Because you're more aerodynamic that way. <laughs> I don't know why you need to be aerodynamic. <laughs> so you can run from the couch to the kitchen faster. I really need to fix my under eyes because they are tragic currently. Oh, I need eyebrow gel. What are we doing? So sometimes I wonder if when I'm filming, I act differently than if I'm not filming, does that make sense? But no, not really. I mean, I act different around humans than I do by myself because you have to interact with people. But when I'm by myself, I definitely talk to myself just like this. <laughs> the camera is just a witness at this point. Do I need eyeshadow primer? How long am I actually going to wear this makeup? Do I wanna do eyeshadow? I don't really wear eyeshadow. Wow, check out that creasing. That is a work of art. Let's fix that. These bits of hair, they really add something. The full uh, two day non-shower chic. Oh, that's attractive. I feel like wearing eyeshadow. <gasps> My light has moved again. I'm sorry, light. I could wear what I used to wear every single day in high school, which was, let's see if you can guess which two colors I used the most. Can you guess? If you guessed this one, 
And this one, you would be correct. Throwback to high school, because everyone knows I loved high school. Why am I doing this so far away? So far away, yeah. Okay, no one wants to hear that, Abigail. Shut up. Do you remember Loud Mindedness, one of my first videos? One thing that's nice about that is you're never lonely. I don't know, there's, there's one thing to say who you are and there's another to be who you are. Those are two very different things, as I'm sure everyone knows. Um, but because that's the case, I feel like people get confused at who they are. But I think that everyone has different aspects of themselves that just get more prominent when they're around different people. So, or by themselves too, obviously. Because obviously when you're with people, you act the way that you want people to perceive you because welcome to society. You're expected to act in a certain way, talk a certain way, be a certain way to fit in, whether you like it or not. I mean, that's just the unfortunate part of society. But I think once you kind of figure yourself out and you begin to understand that people don't actually care, like people care about the same as you care about them, which is Probably not that much, especially if they're strangers. Obviously you care if it's someone who's close to you because they're close to you. You're dedicating time and energy into caring about someone. In that case, then yeah, their opinions matter. Anyone else's? Nope. Does it just look like I got a bruise around my eyes? Probably. See, is this like a super awkward angle? Like me just like, boobs, you know? Like, um, oh, you know, <laughs> if that's the only word that my neighbors heard today. You're welcome. Abigail, let's wear natural makeup in our video today. I wonder if people just think I'm on the phone. Like, I really wonder that. Is that even blended? I don't even know. I feel like it needs to be darker. Should we go darker? Let's go darker. Oops. Well, good thing I have makeup removers, AKA cotton tips. What are those called? Q-tips. Why do I always forget what they're called? Wow, smoky. Smoky girl, smoky girl, smoky girl. Burb. All right, I'm back. Wow, that was exciting. Oh, wow, this is such a train wreck. Look at that, wow. Professional, professional. What, why is it doing that? Amazing what fingers can do. Okay. Are we even? Are we even? See, that phrase has been ruined. Next step who is to add a little bit more of this shine of stuff. Oh my goodness, open. Because it has lost some of its shine. Shiny enough? Shiner. <laughs> yeah, nailed those dance moves. This is the official way to clean your brushes. I hope that this is how you all do it because this is the correct way. All right, cool, great. Let's do eyeliner. Okay, and then actual eyeliner. Well, that was eyeliner, but this is other eyeliner. Are we even? Nope. <laughs> this is gonna take so long to edit. I'm just realizing this as I'm standing here taking like 19,000 minutes on my eyeliner. Okay, are those even? Hmm. They're very close. Ugh. Why? <laughs> Alright, that is as good as, as it's gonna get. We are nearing the end of this journey. Let's do some mascara. Because that is how we pronounce it here in America. My eye is twitching. You know what that means? I am tired. And I did have to get up really early after going to bed really late to take some friends to the mall to go Black Friday shopping at 7 a.m., I think. Which probably isn't that early for some of you insane people who, please don't hurt me, go shopping at the butt crack of dawn or even before dawn. That happens too for Black Friday, which I just don't understand. I hate shopping. Mascara face is always the most attractive. I date that. 
mascara face as a human like personified There's, that's their name mascara face how are we doing how are we thinking is this looking okay hmm? what else do we need mm, highlighter that seems like a good step let's do some highlighter let's add the highlighter oh wow you can't see it in this lighting so we'll just put a lot Ooh, shiny nose shiny nose we can see that that means I've got a lot of stuff on my face add a bit more here because I can't see it so therefore it's not there shall we add a little bit of bronzer <gasps> Abigail and bronzer guess what brush I'm gonna use Ooh, bronzer does so much this is not bronzer wait yes it is bronzer your bronzer right add a little under there to take off some of that Chubba -lubba -lub. All right, I think we're done. Let's do some setting spray. That's not like a good. Oh, lips. Mm, I didn't even know I had this color. I just pulled it out of the bag. I should clean that up later. Let's do some setting spray and be done. Get my Nikki tutorials on. This always scares me because I see it from the toilet, which is right there, just so you know. And it like peers over top of the cotton pads that I have sitting on my counter and it scares me every time I see it. I don't know why I keep using it, but it's a nice kind of size of cardboard to dry my face. Wow, that sounds really pathetic. All right, well, I think that that is going to wrap up my makeup hangout. Did you enjoy hanging out with me? Let's fix this hair because this is just, this is just unfortunate. Okay, well, maybe that looks okay. Does that look okay? I hope that you enjoyed hanging out with me while I did my makeup. I am not going anywhere today, so I'm just going to be sitting all glam. Um, yes, I hope that you enjoyed watching this, and I shall see you in the next video.